I think we have to come to the realization that Nigeria are not going to qualify for a 48 team World Cup. I think that's just the harsh reality here. This is just going to be a very short video because I like there's there's so much anger, there's so much disgust that I don't really want to just go into any more deals. I'm just going to just keep this very short. So this is the reality here. Nigeria have a population of 200 million plus. And you're telling me a population of 200 million plus, Alex Iwobi is one of the best 11 players. I don't care how well he played. I don't care what he did. You can't tell me a football mad nation that out of 200 million plus, Alex Iwobi is one of the best 11 players because he plays in Europe. I believe in local coaches, and I always believe in local coaches. Succeed on the field with um, your local coach. If you need it, George, you're not putting yourself in any good light by benching Boniface for Onacho. I'm sorry, that makes no freaking sense. Like, you can't explain that to, to me. You're just trying to be too clever. Victor Boniface was literally one of the best strikers in Europe, and it helped buy Leverkusen win a league title and a DFP Pokal Cup. So how the hell is he not starting? Many people even argue that if he was fit, he should probably even start ahead of Osime. So what are you doing? But now people now saying that, oh, look at uh, the last coach we had. Who... International football is you have to play with your DNA. When was the last time Nigeria won a major trophy? 2013. Who was our coach? Rest in peace. The great iconic Stephen Keshi. Playing Nigerian football. The issue is not the coach. The issue is the talent on display. Because where is the Victor Moses of 2013? Where is this, the Sunday Umba? Where, where is the Eche Jele? <laughs> okay. Um, where, um, where, are, where, where, where is the Omero? Where is the Obi Mikel? They're not around. And the fact of the matter is that the talent on display is simply not good. And what baffles me is that you tell me that in a country of 200 million where... Football is the main sport. These are the best 11 players you can find. You see, this there's a deeper convo to be had here because it's a convo about coaching, academies, footballing development, and having a process of the under-16s, the under-23s, and there being a actual gradual process of the youth team going into the senior team because not enough investment has been put into football developments in Nigeria. So this goes down to politics and this is a larger issue because it's not just about putting guys on the pitch to play. There's a lot of stuff behind the scenes that happened. Like, like when you just look at what Germany did prior to the 06 World Cup, or sorry, what Germany did prior to the 2010 World, World Cup, there was a lot of background stuff that happens. So unless you put in the work to actually have proper footballing coaching and development, you're going to have situations like that garbage football that we played where we had one shot on target in an AFCON final. And the situation where we now have Alexi Wobi is now is now our main number 10 creative player. Like, you're telling me that Alexi Wobi is the best creative midfielder in the whole of Nigeria. So, look, I've already accepted. We're probably not going to qualify for a World Cup. And it is what it is like. I emotionally checked out after 98. Emot after 98, I emotionally checked out. And then after Yakubu missed from two, two yards out, I was like, you know what? Yeah, yeah, I, th I, th I think I'm, I'm, I'm good on this guy. So I'll, I'll be watching from, from afar, but mental health is more important. Mental health is more, more, more important, you know. So unless Nigeria as a country structurally takes football development seriously, takes organization seriously why should i care so if you don't care the structure the team the, the the coaching people if you don't care and actually invest in nigeria and in its youth and in, in coaching development where the hell should i care like the vid subscribe vids or not